In today's video, I'll be showing you how to transfer crypto from KuCoin over to Coinbase. So in order to transfer crypto from KuCoin to Coinbase, you must first have a KuCoin account as well as a Coinbase account. And when you've got both those set up, we're now ready to begin. This process can also be done on the website or the app as well, so it doesn't actually matter which device you're using. So you want to start by logging into KuCoin. And from here, you want to go into the top right corner over where it says assets. And we can just go down to either funding account or trading account. Now, if your crypto is in your trading account, what you want to do is find the coin that you're trying to send. And from there, you can go over to transfer and then click this button here to send from your trading account over to your funding account. And then you can choose the maximum amount and that coin. From there, the crypto will now be in your funding account. And for this example, I'm just going to be using AVAX. So since we're trying to send crypto from KuCoin to Coinbase, I'm going to choose to withdraw my AVAX. So I can click withdraw over here. So from there, we'll be on this page and we now want to head over to Coinbase. So once you're logged into your Coinbase account, you should be able to go into the top right corner and see this send and receive button. And we can click on that. And from there, since we're trying to send our crypto to Coinbase, we're going to choose to receive. And from there, if you've never done this before, it might say Bitcoin wallet at the top. So what you want to do is click on this and then search for the coin that you're trying to send. So since I was trying to send Avalanche AVAX, I'm just going to choose this one. And from here, we will receive the details we need to send the crypto over. So to start with, we get the AVAX address. So I'm just going to copy this here and we can go back over to KuCoin. So now that we're back over in KuCoin, we can paste in that wallet address here. And you now have to choose the network. So if we go back over to Coinbase, you can see that there's a message at the bottom that says only send AVAX C chain to this address. And this is important because if you don't send your crypto on the correct network, you may actually lose your funds. So since this is telling me to send it via C-Chain, I'm going to send mine on Avalanche C-Chain. So now we can go back to KuCoin and we can select Network. And here we can see AVAX C-Chain. Now luckily KuCoin tells us if the address does not match, but they don't all do this. So you want to make sure you are sending to the correct network. And from there, we can choose how much we are trying to send. So let's just say I was looking to send point one. I could put that in here and we can now review the transfer. So I'm sending AVAX via AVAX C-Chain to this address. So we want to go back to Coinbase and make sure that we are receiving AVAX on AVAX C-Chain to this address. Now, obviously, you might not be sending via AVAX. So if you're sending via Ethereum, for example, you want to make sure this says Ethereum at the top. You will have an Ethereum address here and it will probably tell you to send it via the Ethereum network. So once you're happy with that, you can go ahead and click withdraw. And depending on your account security, you may have to do some verification, such as an email verification or a phone verification, just to make sure it is actually you trying to transfer crypto. However, once you have confirmed that, you would have then successfully transferred your crypto from KuCoin over to Coinbase. And it should appear in your account in about 10 minutes. But depending on the network, it could take longer. If it's been a while and it still hasn't sent over, you can go over to history, and then you can go to the withdrawal tab at the top, and then you want to look at the status, because if the status does not say completed, that will mean that it is still in the process of sending your crypto over. However, when it does say completed, you can go back to your Coinbase and refresh your account, and you'll be able to see it in the My Assets section. So that's how you can transfer crypto from KuCoin to Coinbase. I hope you found this video helpful, and thanks for watching.